going on everybody uh, welcome back to my channel uh, if you're new to this channel my name is Brian I'm the B-Rex beekeeper and today I'm just going to do a quick video it's kind of like my final thoughts about the whole mason jar honey thing so I'm over here right now at the bee yard my veil is crooked ah ah well anyway oh well anyway so just want to do my final thoughts of what I think about it. Uh, this is something that I saw like three, four years ago. Somebody did it online and shown, and it was pretty cool, you know. And I was like, man, I got to do it. And I built the whole bottom board thing and, you know, put a lot of bent holes in it, put the screen on it. Uh, drilled a whole bunch of holes, put the lid down, nailed the lid to the board. You know, you get the idea. So they have ventilation. They're doing good. Uh, so yeah, let me uh, turn my camera around and we'll take a look at it real quick. So uh, here they are. So everything's doing good still. It is an evening now, so it's, I don't have to worry about the heat too much. But almost all of these, except for maybe two, I believe, or maybe three are all capped. They're all capped right now, so that's good. So here is my final thoughts, what I think about the whole mason jar honey thing. Yeah, it's cool. And that's it. Let me explain why. So I installed this nuke along with all these this year. Well, except for that, there's nothing in there. But all these were brand new nukes in March. So that one's full honey, mason jar, full honey, full honey, already extracted, already full, full of honey, full of honey, extracted, put back on, full, almost full, just about full, and over there too, same thing, there's a couple hives over there. So yeah, think about it, already got a full super out of that one and that they already put you know honey in there again and yeah still got my marker on there because the queen keeps getting inside here and queen excluder is not excluding queen queen's not following the rules apparently <laughs> anyway i got a new one in the house i just bought on the old amazon anyway so yeah that's my final thoughts about this I got so much honey from all these hives and I got this much with these and that's it and it was built slow and I've had a lot of comments a, lot of, a few negative ones I had some other people comment about it but uh, yeah a lot of some people said that there's not enough room which yeah it's not enough room. I mean, they only got this. And that's it. Don't sting me, girl. Don't. But anyway, I got an angry girl at me right now because <clears throat> I don't know why. But anyway, where was that? Lost track. Uh, why did I put an inner cover? Oh, Queen of Scooter. Never mind. Sorry. <coughs> so that is my thoughts. It's just not practical it's pretty cool but not practical oh yeah i had some negative comments about it uh i don't know why you give me negative comments about it. i just want to try it <coughs> it's not something that i do all the time i just want to try it see how it works see if you see if i liked it <coughs> sorry about that but i figure if it worked out really good and you got to see it then maybe you can try it and maybe it'll work out for you Maybe it'd be something you would like, but now that you've followed this since March, uh, maybe you understand also that it's just not practical at all. I mean, yeah, you could get three, four times the amount of honey and one good uh, nectar flow, then, <laughs> or the season of nectar flow, then this is giving you. But like I said, it's neat. It's pretty cool. I've had somebody worry about moisture, condensation build up at the top and stuff, and I've never noticed it. 
I haven't had really any moisture issues in this one. Like you can see they've capped almost every single one of them. So it's not, they don't have a whole lot of moisture issues. Are they working harder in there? I don't know. I noticed that they've uh, plugged almost every single one of them. I just noticed that all my vent holes got plugged. <coughs> I'm sorry about that, man. I just got, just getting over a sickness. <coughs> Still got a residual cough. Had the old COVIDs this last week and got over it, but still got a residual cough. Anyway, so there you go, man. That's uh, that's pretty much it. So yeah, that's my uh, that's my thoughts about it. It's neat. Probably won't do it again. Uh, glad I tried it though, because I would always think about it. Like, yeah, I wonder if I could get that mason jar honey to work. Yeah, I remember the. Uh, one person was talking about how much money they made from the jars and then i was like wow man they're making like 30 bucks a jar honey you know that's awesome yeah that's not really the point i'm doing this but it is nice to make some money to pay for your equipment and your new equipment but <laughs> yeah you could probably make 30 bucks a jar on that if you find the right person to buy it like that you know you you have to freeze it and then you, after you get the bees out, you freeze that, and then you, you thaw it out, pour honey into it, and then it's supposed to look neat. But it does, it looks neat, but I don't think I'm gonna do it again. But that is my final thoughts on the mason jar honey. Not gonna do it again, but I am gonna still try new stuff. I wanna try so rose rounds or whatever they're called they're supposed to be a frame with you know the squares in it I'm supposed to pop them off put them in the plastic things i am going to try that i've never done it a lot of people do do it and yeah i'm going to do that probably next year i'm going to buy the equipment here soon and try it out yeah you'll see it you know i'll do it and you can see how that works and see if you like it too if you've never done it if you like it enough to try it after watching me but yeah that's it man not gonna do it again that is my final thoughts on it so thanks for watching uh if you like this video hit that subscribe button also hit the like button and i'm going to keep these videos pumping out so hit that follow button so you get notified when i do a new video i'd appreciate that <clears throat> Stupid cough. Thanks, guys. Appreciate you watching. Later.